The Rockford Ice Sox close out a season-long six-game road trip tonight as they pay a visit to the San Antonio Rampage out at AT&T Center in San Antonio, Texas. Hello once again, hockey fans. Joseph Zakszewski with you alongside interim head coach Derek King for the Forest City Diagnostic Imaging Diagnosis of the game. And Derek, take us through this last contest. You just saw San Antonio a couple of days ago, now trying to reroute the course for this Ice Sox group, trying to snap a three-game losing streak in the process. You want to end this road trip on a high note? How do you approach it? Well, obviously, it's nice playing the same team, so we, we know their intangibles. We know what we need to do. Uh, the big thing here, the message was just we need to stick together as a team. We can't start pointing the finger and, you know, start blaming goalie or blaming a D for bobble pucks or a forward for not hitting the net. We can't do that. we got to stick together. And, hey, guys make mistakes. That's fine. Give them a tap on the shin pads and... Let's go back to work. I'd imagine a couple of these off days, even a practice day here in San Antonio has helped with that cause just because you get away from the game a little bit, but your closest friends are your teammates. So it allows you to get some time together both on and off the ice. Exactly. And I told them that after the game, again, the message was stick together. Uh, we'll get through this. Uh, you know, it's not always uh, fun going on a little three, three game skid there, but the only people that can get out of it is us. And uh, I think we, we had a good practice today and uh, I like our chances. The Rockford Ice Sox offense looking to come alive here tonight against San Antonio. You just have the three goals over the last three games, a couple of tough ones to earn those goals. But how do you get that offense going again? Well, it's just it's constantly beating it into them to hit the net. Uh, you know, sometimes just putting a puck on net's uh, a lot better than trying to shoot a far side roof. Uh, there's rebounds, crash the net. We we got to be a little greasy out there, a little greasier, and and we got to win a little more puck battles. Get it back to the points, crash the net. You know, you get that one off your your butt, off your skate, off the shin goes in. You start feeling good about yourself, and and we'll just go on a little roll from there. So with that being said, the shot count for the Ice Hogs has been a little low here in the last couple of games. With that mentality, is that the green light? Uh, if you have the option to shoot, take your chance. Yeah, we don't want to pass up a shot. Uh, you know, we kept telling them and telling them and. Sometimes they listen, sometimes they don't, but you know, like today in, today in practice here, we're just put pucks on net, put pucks on net, and, and don't give up a shot. If you're in a good, good area to put the puck at the net, let's get there, get it there, and let's crash the net and see what happens. Unlike the Texas team that the Ice Sox saw, that was a lot of speed. It seemed like the San Antonio group a little bit more physical and willing to play the body a little bit more. What's your biggest key going into a Rampage team here tonight? Well, I think the biggest thing is just like what we talked, like uh, we still got to work on our neutral zone. We got to create turnovers, track hard, but when we're in the offensive zone, we don't want to get cute with it. It's either a, a one pass shot or it's a go to the net, put it, put pucks there and, and play down in their end because they are, they're, they're in a, they're a big team. They come hard at you and, and they can, uh, you know, put a little hurting on your, so we don't want that. We just want to score some goals and, and get out of here with uh, two points. Coach King, thank you. Good luck against Rampage. Right, thank you. Interim head coach Derek King joining us here for the Forest City Diagnostic Imaging Diagnosis of the game as the Ice Hogs and Rampage get together tonight. And for Rockford, they're closing out a season-long six-game road trip. You're listening and watching Rockford Ice Hogs Hockey on the Ice Hogs Broadcast Network.